Just when you come up to it, load the shit out of the suspension, push it down, and then just blip it. You can do it. Yeah! Way to go, man. I that last time when I was being a pussy. You know, that was perfect, though. Compress, time that release, and blip. Hello, everybody, and I'm guessing you've watched some of my videos, so you know it is new bike season in the hood. And Jack Buffington, of all people, has gone out and got a Beta 300 cross trainer, and he is having a blast on it. Super cool to see him on the new bike. He's been riding uh, older Suzuki DR slash RMs, and uh, just fell in love with this bike recently. Went out, and pulled the trigger, and got it. So super excited to get to ride it today. And today is bike demo day we got a lot of new bikes out everyone's kind of taking turns on bikes and trying doing little test rods on each other's bikes and just really cool day we got about eight people seven eight people out here from the dfw trail riders in the house and we are out riding twin hills we had some rain the day before and we're getting rained on a little bit today not too much but it has made for some Perfect dirt. Let's check some of this out. So we've got some new guys in the group today riding with us. Uh, DFW Trail Riders group joined up on the page and I think some of them it's their first time out here at Twin Hills. So great to ride with some new folks. Awesome peeps and we're having a great time. And you know really what I wanted to talk about in this video is a little bit about the whole 90% rider 10% bike because that is so true I mean new bikes are great right new bikes are freaking awesome I mean if you're a really shitty rider like I am a new bike is amazing because it makes you a better rider but you know what being a great rider does not require a new bike old bikes make you ride better in my opinion and so you know I think it's just a matter of seat time and getting out there and riding you know I've seen a lot of people that can just tear it up on older bikes. New bikes don't make a difference. Not really. I mean, if you're a shitty rider like I am, 
Well, they make a great difference, you know? I mean, you see a bigger difference because you're shitty. You can't ride very good. <laughs> but, hey, you know, all I'm saying is, really, there's a lot of truth to 90% rider, 10% bike. I mean, it's really about skill and technique. And, you know, you, you, you just got to get out there and get a lot of seat time and really ride. And, you know, that's what makes you good. I think if you ride an older bike, you know, it's a better training tool. You actually learn how to ride better. Then you get on a newer bike and you're like, holy shit, look at all this fucking technology. Anyway, you know, so 90% rider, 10% bike, I believe in it. Come up! Sorry, Stella. First second. Second. That was awesome. Good job, huh? <laughs> Woo! Oh! You can do that. I ain't pushing it. momentum on this you want momentum be going you know what I'm saying yeah. don't crawl up it uh oh he's down this drizzles making it a little slick So one of the cool things about this demo day is we've got a lot of new bikes out here. We've got the new YZ uh, 250X, we've got the KTM 300 uh, XC, we've got the Husqvarna, we've got a Beta. We've got a lot of stuff out here, hot bikes people want to check out and ride. And so this was cool, a really cool day. Everybody got to get a little bit of seat time on some different bikes they maybe haven't uh -oh. rode before. and I mean, that's better than the damn uh -huh. dealership demo days. I mean, yeah. you go out there, what, you can ride it. some Yamaha or maybe some other demo day. You can ride some KTM or, you know, so this was really cool. Everybody really got to get a little flavor on some different bikes and check them out and, uh, what a great group to ride with. Uh, demo day at Twin Hills with the DFW Trail Riders in the house. Check it out.
Yeah, and so uh, Aaron and Ted have swapped butts. Uh, Aaron riding uh, typically is Yamaha 250X, and uh, Ted rides a KTM 300XC with Whoa. a high compression head, I must say. Good save. It's Good a beast. Save. So, anyway, uh, different size guys. Um, you know, they're uh, swapping bikes, and it's really cool to see them both checking it out. You know, I. I think uh, each of their bikes are probably better suited for themselves, but uh, really good to get out here and get to kind of check out other bikes and really see how they run. So uh, cool to see them switching up. And, uh, Ted feels I think the Yamaha is maybe a bit too light for him, and Aaron feels, uh, you know, Ted's bike's a little too much of a beast. So anyway, they're out here tearing it up on it. Either way, 90% rider, 10% bike. Anyway, I'd like to do a big shout out to the new guys, Milan, Matt, Daryl, and Jeremiah. Awesome ride with you guys. I'm so glad you made it up to Twin Hills and you're hanging out with the peeps. Really good times and I look forward to riding with y'all again soon. And so, another glorious day at Twin Hills. Glad you could join us. Thanks for watching. Ride hard, have fun, and I'll catch you next time. Yeah, help yourself. <laughs>